Yeah, good day. This is Chibuzo and yeah, welcome to Blog Info Tech channel. Actually, in this very video, I'm going to show you how you can easily implement Google AdSense Auto Ads in your AMP pages so that AdSense can easily display in between paragraphs of your content because you know most people are finding it difficult as in to implement Google AdSense as between their paragraph because the only available features or the only features that can allow you to do that on AMP is actually the advanced AMP as a, and it will only cost you some extra $29 or so. But in this video, I'm going to show you how you can easily do that for free. Yeah, and that is by the newly introduced Google AdSense Auto Ads. So let's go. The first thing you're going to do, you're actually going to log on to your Google AdSense account. Yeah, this is mine already. I'm already logged in, so I will just go ahead. Then you now look at the left hand corner from the video. Then you now click on what's optimization. <coughs> now it's loading the page. So now from the optimization tab, you look at the drop down menu. You now click on what's labs. Now from the lab you can see uh, I'm already as and I've already activated or already turned on my Google AdSense. I mean my AMP Auto Ads. As you can see, AMP Auto Ads text and display. So I've turned my on. So what you're going to do if yours is off, you're going to turn it on. And after turning it on, you just click on what get code. Click on get code. As you can see, the codes are displayed already. This is the two codes you are going to use. So what you actually do, you can easily open let's say the wordpad document wordpad yeah this is my wordpad so what you do you copy the first code maybe paste paste in your wordpad and give a little bit of space then you now copy the second code and paste yeah this is two codes that you'll be needing actually so if Cutting it from your Google Adsense account. The first one you said you're going to place the code in between the head and the closing head tags. So this way you're going to place the code. Then the next code is said you place the code right after the body tag. So these are the instructions, they are very important. Now, what you now do next, you now go into your log into your WordPress account here. This is mine already. It's already on. So now on your WordPress dashboard, you now click on AMP. As you can see from the right, I'm mean from the left hand menu tab. So AMP now you now go towards settings. You now click on settings, it's loading. You already got your two important codes which you use. Now you now click on settings. Now this is settings. Now from the settings, you now click on advanced settings. I'm already there because I, that's the last page I left so automatically that's where I'm at. so you now click on advanced settings now your advanced settings you now scroll through you see various boxes but you are going to be using just two you can see enter hit cml in head so what you do you now go back to the first code your wordpad actually the two codes you because now you now copy the first code you copy right click copy now what you do now go back to your wordpress dashboard and paste that very code and the portion that says enter html in head you now paste the code mine is already there so there's no need editing it again now you now go back to the second copy copy your second code you now still go back to your wordpress dashboard then in the second box that said enter html in body beginning of body tags that's where you now post the second code you see mine is already there so there's no need editing it now after placing your second code you now click on what save changes save 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 changes so that in order to save the changes you introduce in the advanced setting and after saving your changes Actually, it normally takes even up to 20 minutes, yes, but it might take lesser than that. But from the Google AdSense instruction, they say 20 minutes before the text will automatically appear. Now, that's it. So what you now do, actually, you have to 
test your AMP. After 20 minutes, you have to test if actually your ads is showing on your web page. So you now go through your mobile device. You can use your mobile device and test your AMP pages. Then you now see automatically ads will start displaying. Ads will start displaying in between paragraphs. You know, actually, this is a desktop, so I doubt if we can achieve what I have in my but let's see. Let's see if it will work, but I doubt. I see this is a desktop page, but from your mobile pages, you can actually get what I'm talking about. You can actually get what I'm talking about. So you can see that with this feature, that's a, a Google license auto as introduced by AdSense, you can easily add AdSense to display in between paragraphs. So with this, you earn more, your revenue increases, and that's it. So actually, if you're confused and maybe the video is a little bit clumsy, you can check the description. There's a link to the there's a link to the ascent to the blog page where you can actually read the text and see the steps with the diagrams for. So what you'll do before leaving, just subscribe to my channel. I promise to deliver more tutorials similar to this based on blogging, webmasters issue, so that I can achieve the best on the net. So that's it for our tutorial today how to implement AMP auto ads so that ads can start displaying in between paragraphs of your content so hit the subscribe button subscribe to our channel my name is Chibuza Agora and you can easily visit our website which is blogginfotech.com you can see it in the description so that's it thanks for watching and bye-bye.